Hey everybody, it's Jonathan. Today I'm going to be showing you my top 10 free apps that I've came across so far this year. I know you're going to enjoy this video, so don't go anywhere. Let's go ahead and get right into it. Okay, this first app I'm reviewing is called Extreme Road Trip. In this game, you have a little car that you want to try to maneuver around while doing flips and tricks, but the goal is to land perfectly every time. Now, if you crash, you have to restart the level. So like I said, the, the, the main objective is, is to keep going without crashing. And this is a very addictive game. I've been playing it for a while now. And the best part about this game, it is free. And you can get um, different power-ups and different cars as in-app purchases. So go check this app out. It is free in the App Store. Okay, this next app I'm reviewing is called the YouTube Capture Out by Google. When you get into the app, you want to click Get Started, and you can turn Color Correction or Stabilize on or off. Click Next. Here you can enable Camera Roll to see all your videos. Click Next. Here you can connect all your YouTube, Google+, Plus, Facebook, and Twitter accounts. So let's go ahead and get right into the app. You can see here it says Rotate the Screen to Start. So turn it horizontally, and you can actually take a video and upload straight to YouTube. So let's just take a video here. Of my desk and my Mac. Okay, let's stop that. As you can see here, you can upload straight to YouTube. You can make it public, and you have different options that you have on the actual YouTube site. So, if you love YouTube, I would definitely recommend you getting this app. It is free in the App Store. Go check it out today. This next app I'm reviewing is called the Dictionary.com app. As you get into the app, you can see you have dictionary or thesaurus options. So let's go ahead and click on the search and click app, the word app, and let's search for that. As you can see, it gives you the def definition of app right here, an application, application program. Up here, you can click the voice button. You can actually speak and get the word. Here you can share with email, Twitter, Facebook. We'll click cancel. And you can add to favorites here. This is a very useful app. Is the reason why I'm reviewing it. Go check it out today. It is free in the App Store. Okay, this next app I'm reviewing is called Action Movie FX. And in this app, it allows you to take videos and add certain effects to that video. So let's go ahead and show you what I'm talking about. Let's do the Hailstorm Missile. Let's click Start. Let it load up here. Okay, it says film where you want to want FX to hit. So let's go ahead and take a video of my Blue Yeti microphone here. All right, let's, let's go ahead and tap the record button. And at least five seconds of footage is required. Let's go ahead and record. Wait five seconds. The border will turn green. Click the record button again. And you have your footage, so let's go ahead and click OK. Let the footage load up, and let's click Play. So as you can see here, it's a, it did an explosion on my Blue Yeti microphone. This is a really cool app. I definitely recommend you checking it out. Action Movie FX. Go check it out today. It's free in the App Store. This next app I'm reviewing is called CSR Racing, and it is free in the App Store currently. And it's a racing game, and it's probably not a racing game that you're familiar with. The object of the game is to shift the gears in order to win the race. So you can see here it says Shift Now. So I shift. And it... If you complete the shifts in the manner you're supposed to, you will win the race. So like I said, it's not like a race game you're probably used to, but it is very good graphics, and I've been playing it a lot here lately, so go check it out. And you can get different power-ups and buy different cars in this game. So like I said, it's free in the App Store. Go check it out today, CSR Racing. Okay, everybody, that was my five. Now we're going to turn it over to a special guest that I have on live right now. He runs a channel called The TechnoTuber. His name is Andre. Andre, are you there? Sorry. Yeah, I can hear you, Jonathan. I can actually hear you well. I was just doing something on the wall boxes there. Sorry. 
Uh, so thank you for letting me be in your video, man. And so let's go on with the apps. The first app we're going to take a look at is a free game, and it's called Logo Quiz by Country. This is not the Logos Quiz or Logo Quiz, just the original ones. This is different. All the logos here are actually organized by country. So let's give you a demo here in the level 11 here from France. We have orange. So you just type it in basically and you tap on check, it gives you, you know, the score. Here you have hints that you can actually ch uh, use and here are the stars that you already got. And it's pretty cool because uh, you can really test your knowledge on separate countries and you can compete with your friends using leaderboards and you can get achievements so that's pretty cool. The next app I want to show you is called Fitness 100 Ready Workouts. It's not because of the workouts that I like this app but only because of the calorie counter option in this app. So let me explain. In here you can set a plan for yourself, for example if you want to gain muscles, if you want to um, lose weight or maintain your weight. So you choose that. Then you can set your target weight, how much you want to weight at the end and your target date. So that's pretty cool. You have all the settings here that you can choose from. So what you do is every time you eat something at breakfast, lunch, dinner or if you eat a snack, you have to uh, tab here and then choose what you ate from the database. There's a lot of uh, things in the database here. You can even scan the barcode of the actual product so that you get the exact results of that particular product and here you can tap the glasses depending on how much uh, you know glasses of water that you drank you drank today so as you see I didn't really set anything for today so let's go back to January 8th I actually chose the wrong plan. I actually want to gain muscles instead of um, losing weight. But normally I had 105% here. So this really helps you to organize your eating and stuff like that. And you can really know how much you want to eat and, you know, eat healthy and live healthy. As well as this app has the training plan here. You can add your workouts and activities that you do so that the app knows that you actually burn these calories that you eat. So, I mean, this app is pretty cool. And let's move on to the next one. The next app is called Meme Creator. It's free on App Store and uh, with this app you can actually create memes. If you go to 9gag a lot you'll probably like it. So here you have your popular memes as well as you have your trending, new or you can search for a meme. But not only you can make them like this, you tap on it and then you choose the top and bottom text. You can also view them right here. So if you're bored and you've looked everything in, on 9gag you can just, you know, check for some memes here as well. This next app is a free brand new game which is called Trial Extreme 3. This is one of the most popular games probably on the iOS, those motorcycle games. So let me show you. So here in the menu you can customize a lot of things starting from the driver himself uh, with the money you actually get after the races. Uh, to the motorcycles, so there is really a lot of customization in this menu. It still is the version 1.0 because it came out a few days ago, so it kind of has some glitches or bugs, sometimes it crashes. It's still a pretty good game, it has good graphics, so let's check it out. So this level 1 is not very easy actually, I had some trouble completing it actually, especially getting the stars, this is pretty hard in this uh, game. You need to jump using this button right here, um, this is your brakes. And where I tap every time is basically the acceleration. So, uh, so this is oh crap! I forgot to jump. In this game, it's really important to jump because uh, this is how you get all the stars and stuff like that. Oh, wow, I really can't get any stars here. It, and it's really fun to see the uh, actual player crash sometimes. Like it really has good graphics and uh, physics. So I really recommend this game. I mean, it's free. You have lots of levels to complete, uh, even lots of worlds. And as you can see, your motorcycle is going weird right there. But yeah, let's move to the next one. And the last app I want to show you is called Instant Heart Rate. This is the light version, but it doesn't really have any disadvantages besides from ads and the disability to save your results. But this doesn't really matter. You just want to measure your heart rate, which works in this version. So what you do is you basically, I'll have to grab my iPhone for this, what you do is you put your finger on the camera lens right here and just wait. Don't press or anything, just, just put it on there and then wait. Alright, so there you go. So I guess I have 72 beats per minute, so this is a, the average. And this is a true result, this is not a fake application, it really works. And how this works 
is because the flashlight is on if you put your finger on the camera lens it's lit so it appears red on camera as the camera captures your uh, the image that it gets it actually captures little changes because of the blood and because of the beats that your heart gives it's a pretty cool app because first of all it's free and it's also about health so I really recommend this app I think that's a must-have so that's it with my apps guys now I'm heading it back to your Jonathan uh, Jonathan Yes, Andre, thanks for helping me do this part of the video today. If you haven't subscribed to TechnoTuber, you're missing out. He covers very high quality tech videos and he covers all the Apple news that's recently happening. So go check him out today. Go give him some likes, subscribe to him, and comment on his videos and tell him that Jonathan from today's free app sent you. So if you want to subscribe to my channel, you can do so by clicking here. You'll be informed of my videos once a week. I usually try to do at least one. So go ahead and click it now and you'll be subscribed to my channel. Also, if you want to be directed to other videos by me, you can do so by clicking the video you see below me. And you also see the TechnoTubers video and it'll direct you straight to his channel. So thanks again for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.